Okay, this is to show how to run an express motor, urban, regular, express, whatever, with no battery and not hooked up to anything. What you do have to have is you have to have the coil. And on a CDI engine, you have to have the CDI unit itself. You also have to have an inline switch to shut it off because otherwise it just keep running. What we do is on the main wiring harness, this one was cut so I had to splice into it. You have your red and black wire, which is running down to the CDI unit. You also have your blue and yellow wire, which is also running to the CDI unit. Coming off the CDI unit, you have your green, which is a ground, and that's grounded to the case. Um, you also have a ground running from the case to the coil itself. Okay? Now from the coil, you have your black and yellow. Black and yellow runs down to the CDI unit. Your last hookup is the black and white from the CDI. What that's going to is that's following this, going into my switch, which is simply grounded to the case. And that's all you need to do to wire it to run with no battery or no nothing. Um, your white and yellow wires they don't those are lighting and uh, power for whatever those don't need to be hooked up at all you do have to have your coil hooked up and everything you know like it should be to run but that's your basic wiring and if you want to see how that works this is the uh, black and white which is hooked to the ground and right now it's grounded out so it won't get any spark once you disconnect that ground you can run it And that's all you need as far as the wiring goes to run an express or an urban express. They both work the same way. And the switch simply is to stop the engine. It grounds out the coil, stops the engine. So that's that's a real, real basic wiring just to make them run. If you don't want to run a battery or you're putting it, the engine in something else, that's the simplest way to make them run. But like I said, on a CDI fired one you do have to have the CDI unit otherwise it won't run and this one is the is the urban CDI so it's 12 volt I don't know if it makes a difference if it's 6 or 12 but this is actually the urban one which came from this bike but basically you're looking at one two three five wires to hook up and plus your ground which is I'm using a yellow wires to go into the coil just on the body of the coil and as you can see the black and yellow is hooked up to the actual coil itself right there so if you have any questions let me know